Hello, well, good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel, Academy, Master, Academy Masters. Dear student, it has been a long time uh, since you all are telling me to upload the videos of important questions of the next uh, left out chapters. So today I am going to share with you the importance of next uh, left out chapters. Uh, listen it very carefully and mark it, okay, in your textbook you can mark it or so you can take a pen pencils and listen the instructions properly and mark it since you have only a few days left for the examinations so dear students it's my humble request to all of you that uh, study hard and uh, practice more mathematics is all you have to do is we need to practice so until unless you practice properly you will not be able to uh, get a good marks in maths so everyone, it's a humble request, you must practice it properly, okay? Whatever questions I'm giving, that one you have to practice thoroughly. And beside that also, what if you are done with these questions properly, you can go for other questions as well. It's not that only this one only you practiced, okay? So to start with, last uh, in the last videos, if you have not watched the videos, so then you can um, watch the video from the channel Academy Masters, okay? where I have discussed the important questions of uh, chapter number 1 to 6 and in these videos we are going to discuss the important questions from chapter 7 onwards for class 10 mathematics okay and BSc so dear students uh, from exercise 7.1 uh, question number 3 you can mark it B3 question number B3 B4 B7 B8. It is important question according to me. I repeat exercise 7.1. B3. Question number B3. B4. B7. And B8 are the important questions for your upcoming examinations. Okay. Moving on to the next exercise that is 7.2. In 7.2 question number one is important 7.2 question number one is important okay then question number uh, seven is important question number eight is important question number ten is important okay and in between also there are some questions if you want to practice you can practice but first you practice these questions properly I repeat question uh, exercise 7.2 question number B1 B7, B8, B10. These are important questions you must practice from here. Moving on to 7.3. 7.3, uh, you must practice question number 2. Okay, exercise 7.3. Question number 2. Mm, question number 7. Okay, and question number 4. Okay, so question number 2 and 7, you must practice it properly. Okay, other questions are also there if you want to practice 7. But according to me, question number 2 and 7 is important. So you must practice it properly. So that's all from chapter number 7. We'll move on to chapter number 8, trigonometry. Okay, so trigonometry exercise uh, 8.1. Uh, question number B, okay, B7, it's important, question B7, you must practice it properly, question number B7 and question number B10, it's important for your board examinations. I repeat, uh, exercise 8.1, question number B7 and B10, it's important, okay, so you must practice it. Next, moving on to the next exercise, 8.2, question number 1, Roman number 4 and 5 is important. Last year also, the questions came from here, but uh, this year may not come, but still I feel that you should practice it, because every year there is a question from this section. So you must practice this one, okay, 4 and 5, you must practice from here. Okay, next, moving on to the next exercise, uh, exercise 8.3, question number 2, B2, I mean, 
question number b2 you should practice b3 you should practice b5 you should practice and b6 you should practice this is a very easy exercise so definitely you can make it and last year there was no questions from this exercise so let's uh, practice it properly these are the easy portions where you can score the marks easily so exercise 8.3 b2 b3 uh, b5 and b6 are the important questions from exercise 8.3 now moving on to uh, next exercise that is 8.4 which is very very important exercise dear students 8.4 question number 5 roman number 2 roman number 4 roman number 7 is important and 10 as well i repeat question number 5 roman number 2 roman number 4 roman number 7 and roman number 10 it's important all of you must practice it and here you will get one question three marks every year there is a question for three marks from this exercise and note this exercise from this question among these 10 questions one question will be coming so dear students you need to practice it properly this one okay next moving on to chapter number eight or uh, that nine we are going to start now so nine question chapter number nine in chapter number nine there is only one exercise that is 9.1 height and distance from here it's my, according to my observation dear students for last few years there has been always a question a little bit twist of questions will be there here little bit not much little bit twist in questions will be there that's why i will suggest that here examples also you practice it properly okay and uh, other than that whatever questions you are solving from the exercise understand and solve only simply you are you know practicing without understanding here it will not work because there may be a slight change in the questions here in this section because every year it is seen that there is a slight change in the questions hmm? so you have to understand this chapter properly and do okay so starting with 9.1 question number two is important questions okay and here one five mark questions only it's going to come so all of you need to practice properly one question will be coming for five mark and it will be in all so practice it properly next question number eight question number nine question number ten question number eleven i hope you have marked it then question number 15 and 16 i repeat 9.1 question number two question number eight question number nine question number 10 question number 11 question number 15 and question number 16 okay so practice it properly here five more questions it's going to come next chapter we are going to is chapter number 10 here also we have only one exercises and in this one exercise you will be getting one five mark questions so this uh, in this way this chapter also becomes very important for the board exams so here 10.1 on it uh, it just studies whatever choose the correct or whatever things is there according to the blueprint 10.2 question number three not that question number eight is important okay from here question number 10 is important question number 11 is important 13 is important okay and 15 is important from here okay i repeat question number 8 is important 10 is important 11 is important 13 is important and 15 is important from this chapter 10 exercise 10.2 moving on to constructions from constructions 11.1 Question number three, five, and six is important. Okay, uh, I feel like these uh, three questions are important for your examinations. You can practice all of, but these three you do thoroughly. Okay, three, five, and six. Then from eleven point two, question number three, four, and five is important. Okay, so one question will be coming from here, maybe for three marks. So all of you practice properly okay moving on to chapter number 12 chapter number 12 12.1 12 
एक्सरसाइज 12.1 क्वेश्चन नंबर टू एंड फोर इज इम्पॉर्टेंट ओके 12.1 एक्सरसाइज 12.1 क्वेश्चन नंबर टू एंड फोर इज इम्पॉर्टेंट एक्सरसाइज 12.1 क्वेश्चन नंबर टू एंड फोर इज इम्पॉर्टेंट मूविंग ऑन टू एक्सरसाइज 12.2 12.2 you will see question uh, question number 12.2 b2 b3 and b8 is an important questions i repeat exercise 12.2 question number b2 b3 b8 is important questions and again b11 and b13 is also important for three marks okay i repeat exercise 12.2 question number 2 question number 3 question number 8 question number 11 and 13 is important questions from 12.2 now moving on to the next exercise that is 12.3 from 12.3 question one questions every year used to be there for three marks it is a very easy exercise dear students just you need to practice it properly so from 12.3 b4 is important questions b5 is important b7 looks like important okay and b11 b13 is also important questions i repeat question number 4 is important question number 5 important question number 7 important question number 11 important 13 is important questions so all of you need to practice these questions properly now moving on to the next chapter chapter number 13 so from chapter number 13 13.1 question number 2 is important okay 13.1 question number 2 is important questions b2 then 13.1 question number b6 is important uh, uh, okay is an important uh, like a medicine capsules that is an important questions so you should study from here you will get one five mark questions in chapter 13 next 13.2 question number 2 retail and engineering students that is a very important questions you mark it then question number 4 is important question number 5 is important questions okay So these are five mark questions. Thirteen point two, question number two, B two, B four, B five is important questions. All of you must practice it properly. Next, thirteen point three, question number one seems to be important. Okay, then question number three, question number six, question number seven, eight, and nine is important questions. Okay. So here, question number one, question number three, question number six, seven, eight, and nine is an important questions from here. Okay. Next, moving on to question number thirteen point four. So from thirteen point four, the first term comes. Question number two and question number four is an important questions. Question number two and question number four is an important question. You must practice it. so that's about your question uh, chapter number 13 next moving on to chapter number 14 where you will get eight marks so here uh, from 14.1 question number 3 or oh, sorry question number 2 must be practiced properly question number 4 must be practiced properly 14.1 b 2 b 4 B seven and B nine must be practiced properly, both step deviations and elimination. Uh, sorry, step deviation and assuming method both is important. Last year did not come, so may be asked this year. So all of you must practice. Next, moving on to fourteen point two. Fourteen point two. Uh, chances are very less from this uh, chapters for the questions to be asked. But still, then you can uh, practice question number three and four. If you want, you can practice it. Uh, question three and four, okay? Because nine already came last year. So 
नेक्स्ट एक्सरसाइज फोर्टीन पॉइंट थ्री सो फोर्टीन पॉइंट थ्री क्वेश्चन नंबर वन इज इम्पोर्टेंट टू इज इम्पोर्टेंट थ्री इज इम्पोर्टेंट एंड फाइव इज इम्पोर्टेंट सो आई रिपीट एक्सरसाइज फोर्टीन पॉइंट थ्री क्वेश्चन नंबर वन टू थ्री फाइव इज इम्पोर्टेंट क्वेश्चन ओके then question number exercise 14.4 dear students here uh, one thing you have to remember that question number 3 came last year okay for 5 marks so here or uh, question number 2 came last year for 5 marks so you have to study here question number 1 and 3 properly question number 1 and 3 you have to study properly this is a 5 mark questions so all of you you have to study properly dear students moving on to chapter number 15 chapter number 15 uh, only one exercise is there and there will be one three mark questions so here the questions which i feel is important is question number 6 8 9 30 6 8 9 30 I repeat, fifteen point one question number six, eight, nine, thirteen is important, and sixteen, seventeen, twenty-one is an important question. Sixteen, seventeen, twenty-one is an important question from exercise fifteen point one. So, dear, so here is the end of these important questions, and my suggestion to all of you is that. practice these questions properly and decide that if you are getting time you practice other questions as well dear students <clears throat> okay and uh, don't be nervous just one suggestion is there that uh, practice properly as when i am recording this video right now you are left with around 6 or 5 uh, 5 days you are left with for your examinations so every this five days at least two hours practice mathematics dear students so that you can uh, you know understand or you can have a good practice on the uh, important questions which i have given you or else in during the exam time it is very difficult to revise all the things within one to two days of gap so from now onwards you start giving two two hours at least uh, every day or three hours depending upon your studies preparations so that you can do well in mathematics and yes if you are new to the channel dear students don't forget to share and subscribe the channel because i used to see the so, uh, most of you are viewing the channel but you are not subscribing so you should subscribe the channel and share with your friend as much as possible so that they also can get help from this video and they can do well in their examinations thank you so much dear students all the best for your examinations and yeah regarding science uh, dear students Let's see. Very soon, I will try to upload the videos for science also. Okay. Till then, thank you.